Hi. Hi, welcome to Clean Easy. In this first of a series of short training videos, I'm just going to show you how to get your Clean Easy business up and started so you can get out there and start making money straight away. Now, you will have received your, um, your starter kit and in there you'll have your catalogues. So what you'll have in the box when you open it up is you'll have three sets of catalogues. Now, your catalogues um, will look slightly different to these because obviously this video was recorded before you started your business and the catalogues do change with. But you will have um, a special log, so this seasonal special log. This will be either um, a, like a January sale, a spring or summer special uh, as this one is, maybe a DIY or a Christmas one. You'll have what we call the Clean Easy Main Book. Now this is the book that has inside of it all of the cleaning products, um, and our kitchen range and garden range. You'll also have the Health and Beauty Book. Uh, and this trio of catalogues are what make up the catalogue pack which we send out to our customers. In the box, you'll also have the order forms. Each catalogue pack has an order form in, so people can easily flick through the catalogue, choose what they want to order, fill in the order form, and they leave it out for you to collect. To protect your bags from the weather, because we do have some rain in England, um, you will have uh, plastic bags. This will all be inside your white box um, of catalogue, so you've got everything that you need to get started. You will have received from ourselves um, a welcome pack um, with a CD in it which will have templates on of any extra slips that you need. Uh, the crucial ones at the moment will be your day slips. Uh, I will also email these over to you. Um, and you want to print out enough day slips for the amount of catalogues that you've got just for the day that you're going to collect at the moment. So we put the catalogues out and collect them back two days later. So let's say that uh, you're putting your catalogues out on a Monday you would print out slips for Wednesday. Okay, and these go inside the front of the catalogue. They tell you, um, the people that you've left the catalogue with, what day you're picking it back up. You then simply go back out on that day and collect the catalogues up from the doorstep. So it makes it very, very simple. Now to get started setting your catalogues up, this takes a little bit of time. Um, I suggest you find yourself, you know, a good film on TV, a cup of tea, and settle down in front of the TV you know, with your catalogues and just get them bagged up and ready. It's a bit like if you were opening up a shop or something like that, before you could start selling any goods, you've got to get the fixtures and fittings in the shop and get it get it upright you know, and get it ready. Uh, those sort of bits are just um, you know, a little bit time consuming, um, but you know, it's just something that's got to be done to get you onto the exciting bit of getting out there and earning the income that you're after. So how we set the catalogues up, um, You'll notice on, notice on the order forms that there's a space uh, in the top right of the order form here for your details. Now you will have um, address stickers, contact details stickers come through from the company. Um, you may also have some extra ones from ourselves. So one of those on each of the order forms. Okay, so the customer knows when you know when you've delivered the goods. The customer's got a record of your name and number as well in case they need to contact you. Also place uh, a contact detail sticker in this white box on the back of the main catalogue. Just the main catalogue, you don't need to sticker up every catalogue. This just identifies the catalogues as yours. Um, let's say, you know, catalogues left lying around the house, someone forgets to put it out, um, and they pick it up, and you know, they've lost this front slip, something like that. At least they've got your contact.